And thanks for joining us. We just want to do a quick demo here of Red Hat Universal Base Image to kind of show you how it works. So on the left, you'll see we have a Fedora test system where we are going to build uh, a new container image from the Red Hat UBI base image. And then on the right, we have a RHEL 8 test system that we're actually going to run it. Um, we are going to share it using Quay.io, which is a uh, publicly available registry server that you can push your own images to and share them with other people. And so we're gonna kind of show you these three things all working together. So let's take a quick look at a Docker file I created. Um, in this doc file, you'll see we are pulling this Red Hat Universal Base image. Again, this is publicly available on Red Hat's registry. Um, and you see we just embedded a maintainer, then we install a package. Uh, you'll see that UBI comes pre-configured with a set of YUM repositories, so it actually has extra packages you can pull and install, um, one of them being a web server. And then we are going to just echo hello world, expose it, and then fire up the web server. So let's go ahead and build this. Let's fire this off, watch this build happen. You'll see it's pulling packages from the publicly available YUM repositories. And now it's installing the software. You'll see these packages are all RHEL 8 packages, but they are released under a end user license agreement that allows for redistribution. So these are essentially publicly available. You'll see we've built the image now. Uh, we have the image locally. You'll see we have the Quay.io Father Linux UBI demo. Let's run it real quick just to test it before we push it. Uh, we are going to fire it up, expose port to 8080. Um, let's fire it up. There we go. Okay, let's do a curl. Okay, there's hello world. So we have a running web server. Let's push this image up to Quay.io here. You'll see it's pushing the image layers nice and quickly. Uh, let's write the manifest. Okay, image is pushed. Let's go over to our RHEL 8 test box where UBI 8 was really designed to run in production. Um, and then let's do a Podman images. Uh, let's do a pull. Let's pull this thing down. See, it's pulling all the image layers. Okay, we have our image now. Um, see the UBI demo. Again, let's run it like we did on the other system. Man, run. Okay, so we fired it up. Now let's curl up the host. There's a hello world. So what I've shown you here is that you can freely distribute, uh, you know, UBI-based container images that you build yourself. So applications, you can build your own application, share them um, on UBI. And it really gives you a you know an on-ramp to a supported environment if you want one, but at the same time provides a great base image no matter where you want to use it. So thanks for joining.